Okay, welcome to this uh, short WP Local Biz video on how to set up the Quote Rotator plugin. Now it's called the Quote Rotator because um, I think originally it was intended to, to rotate quotes and testimonials and things like that, and certainly that's what we're using it for with the uh, WP Local Biz uh, theme. But uh, you can actually rotate any HTML uh, text. So um, the section that um, we've got it programmed to go into is this one here uh, which is uh, an area that's blank at the moment because I haven't got the thing set up but uh, yeah that area there and you can see that it says no quotes found but um, yeah, you, you can have um, and I'll set this up in a minute you can have uh, testimonials there what our clients say what our customers say whatever and then have your your um, your quotes your, your uh, testimonials rotating and we can set the uh, the fade in, the fade out, the speed of the rotation. It's pretty versatile. But if you didn't have any uh, quotes or uh, testimonials, or uh, you wanted to feature something else like SEO tips, or um, you know search tips, or whatever you wanted to um, put in there, you could uh, you know you could do. If, I mean, this is a a, a local current practice service. You could have you know, uh, questions people ask about, um, you know, um, chiropractic or, you know, questions people ask about plumbing or common questions or whatever. You know, whatever you wanted to have, you could be pretty creative and um, and have it, uh, you know, rotating in there. But uh, for the um, all intents and purposes today, we're just going to use some dummy text. And... Um, yeah, so uh, let's uh, get started on this, and we'll just go back into the go into the back end here, and um, in the dashboard. Now, assuming that you've um, uploaded and activated the Quote Rotator plugin, if you haven't, what you'll see in that blue box is a heap of code that says "fatal error," um, etc., etc. So, if you see that, means it's a prompt or a reminder that you haven't set up your plugin properly. Okay, so what we're going to do is go along to uh, settings here. Where are we? Yeah, quote rotator here, and we'll just set up the um, the way that we want the quotes or the ro the uh, testimonials rotating in and out. So the title we can have whatever you like, but uh, we're just going to have here yeah what our clients say. That's what was what we had before. Delay in seconds. Now that means the amount of time that you want a particular piece of text to stay in place before it fades out and gets replaced by something else. So we'll say 10 seconds is pretty good, and um, yeah, th oh wow. three seconds for the duration of the fade in is three seconds, and three seconds for the duration of the fade out. Now this height override, width override, don't worry about that. Uh, style sheet none. Uh, we've taken care of that. Don't have to play around with that. You can have random rotation of the of the uh, testimonials or the quotes or not. I like to have that on yes, but entirely up to you. So we save the changes, and um, we still haven't got any quotes. If we go back and we refresh the page, it'll just have no quotes found. It might still have no quotes found, but. Um, We've got that uh, basically set up, ready to. Uh, here we go. Yeah, what our clients say is what I just put in there, but there's still no quotes found. So we need to fix that. So we're going to go into the back end again, and now we go into uh, tools and go to quotes. Okay, and this is real easy to do. All you do is add a quote. So the quote goes in here, and the author, whoever it is, goes in here. What I'm going to do is to uh, borrow some uh, dummy text that I have got over on the other site. So just copy that across, and this is basically going to be your testimonial. Okay, so we'll just say uh, a a person said that. Okay, and then we'll do another one. Okay, this one here. Not that it really matters, but just make them a little bit different. And then the second one's going to go in there, and that can be a bloke here. And the third one, we can have um, 
say a client okay so save that add quote so you can see that we have got uh, three quotes there you can have as many as you like I've just done three for the purpose of demonstration and if you want to edit them just come back and edit them if you want to delete them entirely just delete them entirely now let's go back and see if we got that right okay so we refresh the page here and loading quotes yep there we go see we've got all our um, uh, testimonial there and that will stay there for about 10 seconds then it'll fade out for three seconds and the new one will fade in for uh, three seconds here we go so it's fading in and there you go okay so that's pretty much uh, basically um, how uh, you set up the um, quote rotator for your testimonials there if you just wanted uh, one quote in there not to rotate well you just have one quote in there instead of three and um, yeah there's a number of things that you can do with that's got a lot of options but uh, that's pretty simple basically that's uh, all you do and you are good to go so I hope you've enjoyed this uh, short uh, video tutorial on how to set up the uh, quote rotator plugin uh, I'm Russell Hall for WP Local Biz look forward to seeing you on the next one bye now